Hey everyone, welcome to the Moose Crew, Moo here, and today we're going to be taking a look at the Reflector, or Refractor, or all the other different names that they have for them. Let's open the book real quick. You got Scrap Face, who's in the back. You got, you know, your standard Refractor, uh, who was a re-release, and then you have the Special Edition with Viewfinder, Spectro, and Spyglass. So, we have all these new ish <laughs> really not new anymore right figures but i thought we could take a look at them together and check out the articulation and all that good stuff so as you can see lower arm uh bicep swivel you got the double jointed elbow wrist swivel head that goes extremely back and of course it's on the mushroom peg so not a whole lot of up and down otherwise that neck legs you got the thigh swivel you got the extreme ankle rocker and the up and down on the toes uh once again, it can kick all the way to his back, which is mostly for transformation, as you'll see later. And up to the front, he can, of course, kick out and do the kick kick to the side. And T-pose. <laughs> so they all have the same articulation, right? So I'm not going to go through that on all these figures. But you can take a look and see just how beautiful these guys look. I really like uh, the, the, the special edition ones. And there's a lot of variety in the, the paint deco with this pack. Um, unfortunately, I don't care for like the camera belly button <laughs> just being black. I, I get it. It matches well with this guy. It looks amazing with this guy. But kind of clashes with the other ones. But it, it's fine. Let's go ahead and, uh, man, that deep, deep red. I like it. Oh, and here we go with the original. And we got the purple. That purple. That purple is hot. Like, I don't know about you, but I really love that purple. And, uh, and of course, you got the scrap faces in the back showcasing how awesome they are. And this is uh, scrap faces combined. Uh, they all have their own little combined camera mode with different, you know, colors and arrangements. Uh, we have the special edition refractor on the far left. You have your standard uh, three of a kind to combine to become a reflector, the camera mode that was uh, Siege. And then you have Scrap Face, which was the War for Cybertron TV show Netflix line camera. Something I really wish they would have done with this camera was paint that lens red because that red translucent that's on the shield of the camera looks absolutely beautiful so the orange i don't really care for so much but that red that deep red that looks so good and with this guy the standard original release his stand is kind of that gray um the refractor that we just looked at scrap face it's more like a black stand right uh this one looks the best in my opinion if you can paint the lens green it looks really good and you see at the top you can like kind of clip something on top well that thing that you can clip on top is uh this right here refractor he has where it says refractor that's kind of like a zoom lens where you can kind of look into it right then you have uh like a flash and on the right it's where you actually press the button to take pictures it's pretty cool and if you want to be silly you can actually combine them all together if i had two more i think i can make an even looking camera and finally they all have their little spaceship modes it's interesting. I wish, uh, I don't know. Something feels like it's missing, right? Uh, something about it. It's neat that they have a spaceship mode, and I think it would look cool if you kind of put them up, uh, like via <laughs> fishing line or something. So it looks like they were floating in space uh, in like a display. But it's not for me as far as uh, doing that. But I, I like it. Um, I think who has the best of these uh, would be um, probably... No, not this guy. It's, it's hard to tell who I'd prefer. Um, if I had to choose one of them to have the best space mode, I would probably go with the, the purple one again. <laughs> I may be biased. Maybe a sucker for that. Or the red and black. Red and black looks good, too. Um... The problem with these other colors is that big black shield just kind of clashes with the rest of the, the color of the figure. Where it, oop, <laughs> it's not drop things. My stand doesn't want to stay up. Stay up, stand. 
Stand up. <laughs> there we go. See, now that looks... Oh, man, that red, that deep red looks good. That red and black. It, I, I don't know if it's cliche or not, but it is a sweet combo for me. I love it. So would you display any of these in space mode? Which ones would you display? I do like the blue. The blue looks nice, but you know, I'm not sure who I'd, I, I, I don't think I'd actually display any of these in uh, <laughs> their, their, their spaceship mode. They, they have potential to be kind of cool in spaceship mode, but I, I just don't think displaying them like this is really worth it. Uh, just the real estate, unless you can hang them up, then it'd look cool. Well, I hope you've enjoyed looking at these with me. Um, the rest of the video is just gonna be some like Transformers Devastation music playing, along with um, just some pictures I took of these guys. So feel free to enjoy. Uh, I'm gonna talk a little bit about what's been going on for those that care. Uh, the reason I haven't uploaded in about a month is it comes to new job. Didn't have power for about a week or two. No, it was a week and then like didn't have drinking water that was from the tap uh, for like another week. It, it's been crazy over here, right? Um, but beyond that, I try to stay active on Twitter at the very least. All right, well, I'll leave you to it. Thanks for listening. Bye.